We're excited uh, to open the season on Wednesday against UCLA and then uh, two days later against UC Irvine. Both very good teams, and and this is what we've been waiting for, to see what we are. Uh, you get an indication in practice. Uh, you think you're doing things well, and you think you're good at this and that, and then reality can slap you in the face when you open up with play, that uh, uh, there's going to be things to be worked on, and we all know that's coming. Hopefully it will be after a victory, but uh, it'll give us a good starting point, kind of see where we are as a team uh, heading into this season. How does this year's team stand out to you? What do you think the strengths are, the identity of this team so far that you've seen? Yeah, I think for this team, um, I think we're going to have to figure out our, our identity. I think figuring it out comes with jumping into the fire. And um, like last year, you know, we found out that we were able to win on the road at BYU. I think this year we're going to have to figure out what we're about. Um, you know, we can talk about it all we want, but when we play UCLA, UC Irvine, St. Mary's, and and uh, Colorado State and Arizona State, I mean, you're going to find out what you're about. Uh, so I think we're going we're gonna to find out, and I think that this team is going to be up for the challenge. And no matter what happens, we'll, we'll go through it together. And uh, in a year unprecedented like this, I mean, it's just – <laughs> that's all we can be is together and, and play our best and come out with the energy that we had last year and everything will take care of itself. Knowing Viejas Arena is going to be empty, knowing there's going to be some different schedules than in normal years, what are the challenges that you see for this team this season and how will you guys need to overcome those? I see our biggest challenge this year um, is creating our own energy and also um, being able to come together through adversity. Um, uh, just because that we won't have an exhibition game, we won't have a scrimmage um, like we did last year against Point Loma and San Diego Christian um, to work out those those little kinks and then watch the film and really understand um, what it may be that, that we need to catch up on and, and, and fix on the fly. Um, and now it'll really be on the fly uh, because we're starting off against a ranked team in UCLA. Um, and so, um, we just got to come in and be tough. Uh, that's all I'm asking for the, these guys is, is for them to be tough. And, and uh, I've spent uh, every day now going at them in practice and, and, and really doing my best to test these guys, um, not only f physically, but, but mentally and, and making sure they're in the right place. How prepared do you feel for the season starting now and against UCLA? How, how prepared do you feel for that? And is it kind of impossible in a season like this to feel, like you said, as prepared as you normally would in a regular season? It's definitely impossible um, to feel the most prepared as possible. Um, but I think that we are um, as prepared as we are going to be, um, as any team would be. Um, I feel like the coaching staff has has tested us um, day in and day out um, and really grinded our gears and really in hopes to to bring this team together. And this team has come together nicely. Um, our, our chemistry is, it has only gone up from, from where it started. Um, and and these guys have, have come in, like I said, with, with no agenda. Uh, all these guys have good hearts. Um, none of these guys are, are, are coming in um, thinking of personal stats. Uh, all these guys just want to win. And, and when you just want to win and you have no agenda on your mind, uh, it makes it pretty easy. I think we got great shooters again. We got uh, guys that can knock down shots. We got guys that can get to the rim. We got bigs. We got Nate coming back, who's going to come back and dominate on the floor, I already know. So, I mean, we got a lot of good pieces that can come in and, you know what I'm saying, make up for the pieces that we lost. And just, I mean, the team, I mean, I'm liking what I see with the team. I mean, I think we'll have a good, good team.